This is Wild Rivers, and this is Black is the New AP Style. Now you guys from Canada have never been to Chicago. First time deep dish in. Oh First time. yeah. First so time. let's dig in. So you guys dig in. Tell me what Whoa. you think. Mm. I'm cheesy. a big fan. I'm very cheesy. I'm adding some tomatoes yes. since I picked one up. <laughs> All right. Really good. So what do we think? I think it's great. I love thoughts? it. I love it. Okay. I really love it. Glad we picked this then. So first thoughts then. Obviously, you guys released the album like almost a year ago now, mm -hmm. and you're putting out new stuff. So tell me what has changed between then and now. A lot. Yeah. <laughs> Um, okay, where do we start? We released them in April. Since then, we, we went on tour pretty soon after that, I believe. Or in, or in June, I guess, so not that soon after. Um, we've done a couple tours of Eastern Canada and a bunch of shows locally um, near Toronto and yeah. general Toronto area. And then we went to, we got our visas in October, went, did a little US run in in October, November, so we went to New York, Boston, Providence, where else did we go? Washington. East Coast. Washington. Um, and then we recorded our new single earlier this year. Right. And we just released it right before coming on this tour, so yeah. it's been, a lot of things have happened, but it's been really exciting. Honestly. So what, as, as far as musically too, has changed since the first album? You guys have obviously progressed and you've grown and everything. So what made you decide to do this kind of sound this time around? Um, so the first album is actually kind of cool because um, we weren't even fully formed as a band yet. Right. It was uh, it was Devin and myself mm -hmm. and uh, we, we knew these guys and uh, and initially, initially brought Ben on just to play drums on our album. Mm -hmm. So we worked some parts, and uh, and then it's very, like very so organically much. just like started working. Right. And uh, and then soon after, Andrew Andrew came along as a friend of Ben's, and it all kind of just it all just kind of happened, and it and it worked because we were we were looking to to expand a little bit and to 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 try new things. So now, so now is the first time that we're that we're all writing songs together, and we're all from the start kind of um, coming up with like completely new ideas that isn't stemming from an acoustic guitar and a voice, mm -hmm. um, which is cool. We get we get to some interesting places for it, from it. So tell me about that first jam session as four of you. What was that like? Where you were like, okay, this will work. Andy, what do you think? <laughs> no. Uh, yes, you too. Tell me everything. What was your I don't, you can edit this out if this is weird things to say, but um, <laughs> one of the first things Cal said to me was some joke about like how his father's never around. Or something. <laughs> like, yeah. like literally the first like I mean, first weird. two minutes, and I, I that's his sense of humor. But I just thought it was like really real and <laughs> just unloaded kind of some realness on there. Yeah, you asked me. It stressed me out a little bit, but uh... It's like, oh, there's too much baggage in this band. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was just weird. Remember, you, you asked me after, like, after the first session, you pulled me aside, and you were like, so what's the deal with Cal and his dad? <laughs> did, did, he, did he ever know him? Like, I'm like, I feel like that happens all the time. I gotta, I gotta come in a little less hot with the, with the jokes. Yeah. But. Yeah, so it was pretty cool. <laughs> uh, other than that, like, musically, it was, it seemed pretty easy. Um, Felt pretty natural and we got along. Mm -hmm. I remember when yeah, I remember when we first saw Jam together. It was pretty funny. We were like anticipating meeting you. No, uh, luckily you have, we liked you. Do you have any preconceptions <laughs> of me? I had no idea. Yeah. I did Ben obviously knew you and I just knew what Ben had told me about how you knew each other and the previous history. We were late. We, we walked in on you in Guitar World. Oops. Guitar World um just ripping. And I was like, I like this guy. <laughs> <laughs> so what about the music scene by you guys? Has that influenced you at all about the way that you guys perform or the way that you guys write or anything? What do you mean by that? 
mm. as far as like influences was there an influence for you that was in kind of your seed either as you were starting or as you were growing up that kind of made you want to do this i think we all have different influences in terms of what we listen to but we all kind of converge on on certain artists mm -hmm. um which is why i think it works so well and and all the music we listen to we all like each other's music but we all bring in something mm -hmm. a little different which is cool so what was that conversation like of the like you said that all four of you kind of do the songwriting and everything together so how did that kind of conversation come about of like okay we all want to collectively do this versus just one or the other doing it um it kind of just seemed like the natural progression um like initially i I would come to the band with with a song idea, and it would kind of it would just be lyrics, melody, guitar, acoustic, um, and then uh, a couple Devin and I co-wrote, and uh, it's something that like we all we all at at some stage it becomes like a very collaborative thing from mm -hmm. from the from the initial, mm -hmm. um, so it just makes sense at at this point. Um, that we can all put our heads together and, and find common ground and come come from different ideas of different areas. It's cool. We wrote a song in Nashville, which was pretty cool. Very inspired once you get into that city. Oh gosh, yeah, that's such a great city for music, mm -hmm. everything related. Mm -hmm. So tell me about, I mean, I know this has been your first time in Chicago, but for the other stuff, this was, I'm assuming, your first time as well to kind of hit the East Coast and everything. So what were your first impressions coming out here and, and playing your music? To the to Chicago. Specific. Yeah, just like when you guys you said we we're doing the East Coast tour and everything too. Um, sorry for like U.S. in general. Yeah. Oh, okay. Um, the first time we played in the U.S., it was really we were pleasantly surprised because there actually were, were people coming out to the show, so that was kind of an initial relief, and it, it kind of just it was very motivating for us to see that we actually do have support in these markets that we've never been to so that's what kind of motivated us to keep coming back and and trying new places and that's what brought us here this time as well mm -hmm. so what's next for you guys i mean obviously you're recording new music with the new sound and everything so what's the plan for the rest of the year um we love the states we've like all of our new new cities we've been to we've had awesome shows mm -hmm. um I think we got put on a, a couple Spotify playlists that gave us a bunch of new fans and we can actually come out here and have like a decent tour which is really cool. So we're definitely going to come back here a lot and, and start start kind of circling out and hopefully make it to the west coast. Um, I'd like to see if we can make it to the UK. I would love to we'll make see. it to the UK. And then we, we actually haven't gone across Canada either which is... We haven't done the west. Oh okay. Yeah. We've done the east. Okay. Which is like a mammoth distance, but I definitely want to do that too. So, lo lots of exciting stuff happening for the band, and lots we're just of kinda, ground to cover. Yeah. Yeah. Try to focus on new music first and see what happens. Yeah, well, it's going to be exciting. I'm looking forward to the rest of it. Thank you. Thank yes, you. well, thank you guys for sitting down and eating some deep dish pizza <laughs> with me. Thank you. Thank you for bringing it. Of course. So good. Of course. We'll catch you guys next time.